Collins, gold medal, European Open. Tell me how you're feeling right now. Um, yeah, good. Obviously, it's nice to come away with a gold medal, four fights. I think I won four weapons as well. So, yeah, overall, it's a, it's a great day. I needed something like that because I've gone to a few tournaments, took medals and final placings, but winning the tournament is something different. You know, it's a mentality thing. So to actually go and get the medal and win the tournament, it's, it's a really important step again. Yeah, it's been a good year for you in terms of placings and stuff, but yeah, just to win one. Tell me the kind of reasons for here. Was it the crowd? Was it the form you're in? What, were the kind of, what drove you on to victory? I think a few things contributed. The crowd's actually been really good today. I was really pleased. Sometimes it's a, it's a struggle in, a, in Britain when you fight because there's a bit of a nervous tension amongst the crowd. But today it was good. I, I felt a lot of, uh, you know, took a bit from the crowd. There's a, quite a bit of passion in the crowd today. So I was really pleased with that. And I'm in good form, yeah. So, that you know, that's definitely really important. If I can keep maintaining that and just keep going. You know, I, I didn't taper off as much for this tournament because the ranking points ain't as high, but I still needed to put in a performance because it's on home turf. So it was really important. Going into this, you were probably the overwhelming favourite, I would say. Home crowd, ranking, experience, and all that. Did that? Did you feel any pressure? Not really, because I have a, I have a decent. I find that I have a good mentality the way I set myself out. Sometimes you can put pressure on yourself, and you know people sometimes have different methods of relaxing. But I always just whenever I come into any tournament, I always say, <clears throat> just fight your best. People will never be disappointed with you if you fight to your best of your ability. And if you lose doing that, then anyone can say anything to you, you're fine. So I always just have that in my head when I'm stood there waiting over on the, the edge of the mat. I'm like, look, just fight to your best. If people are disappointed with you after that, that's their problem, not yours. So I just keep that mentality going. And I've, you know, through the years, I've had quite a bit of help from Patrick Grew and a, a guy out in uh, France who he used to know and really good with the kind of psychology aspect of things and, you know, um, mental skills that he, he taught me. And I think they've been a, a real vital ingredient to help me to this success that I'm at the moment. What's next now? Asia Tour. So after this, it's going to be Abu Dhabi, Japan and Korea. So it's free. It's a tough 19 days. I've got uh, free, free weight makings and then a fourth at the end because the trials is after that. So I've got four, four, four lots of weight making, which is the tough part. But with the evening weighing, it's a bit better. But yeah, the, the Asia Tour, I, I hope to just go there and just keep things rolling. It'd be nice to get some more points and... Uh, try and get a few more medal matches would be great again and major focuses now for the next 12 months um long term is obviously the world championships i mean i've had a fifth before i fought well this year but i, I really need a world medal to my collection that's that's my real one target i have a european medal i have a grand slam a grand prix so that's my one my one target right now and since the games is such a long way off it's got to be the main focus so that's the 12 months but i i say the same to when i talk to my girlfriend about um developing like, as long as I keep getting better and I keep improving in the 12 months I'm happy because that's all you can ask of yourself if you start saying oh I've got to get this or I've got to get that and you pin too much on different things it's not good for your development the more you just say look be a better player each day and it's a corny little line you know but at the same time if you're a better player each day you can be happy congratulations Cole great result